Hello my fellow readers, today I'm going to be talking about how I rate the books I read. Now I'm very very similar to the way Goodreads has their star program with the five star rating. However, I fudge things a little bit because Goodreads doesn't have a really strong dislike or hate category, and so I have changed it up just a little bit. So here we have a one star, because I do not give books a zero stars. I've never deemed a book worthy of a zero star, because I don't even know what I would give it. I mean, unless it was like complete garbage. Because a one star is a book I hate or I disliked it to such an extreme that I did not finish the book. A 1.5, because I do half ratings as well, is a book I found just boring, lackluster, something I really could not grasp and get interested in. A two star rating is a book I disliked most of it. It didn't really have any redeeming qualities. There was maybe a couple things I liked about it, but for the most part, I disliked it. A 2.5 is a book I disliked, but it did have some redeeming qualities, whether it was a fantastic ending or a great prologue or there was a character I just really, really loved. Then I got a 2.5. A three star rating is a book that was okay. I neither disliked it or liked it a lot. And I definitely don't feel bad for reading it or that I disliked it. I was just okay. A 3.5 was a good book. Something that I did like. It was fairly fast paced, well written. There might have been a few things that I didn't like going on a couple plot lines or character side stories or characters in general that I didn't like, but for the most part I thought it was a good book. Now a 4 out of 5 is a great book. Something that I really highly think about. There might have been one or two bugs in it, but I still really loved it, would recommend it, and I would definitely potentially pick it up again in the future. A 4.5 is an excellent book. Love the writing style, the plot, the background, the setting, everything about it. But there might have been a little smidgen of something that irked me. A five star rating is such a great, phenomenal, fantastic book. I will definitely reread it in the future. No questions, hands down, something I love so, so much that I can't stop talking about it. Anyway, that is my basic, basic five-star rating skill. Every once in a while, I'll come across a book that deserves a quarter star because it doesn't quite fit into the half or the full star category. That doesn't happen often for me, but it will happen every once in a while. Anyway, I would love to hear how you rate your books, and until next time, I'll see you. Bye!